I definitely have questions about what's happening to the animals in Arcadia Bay. Oh, many do. These poor creatures have no choice in what happens to them. How can anybody explain all those poor beached whales? My dad was a fisherman, and he'd take me out to hear the whales sing. Now they... they just cry. They're not alone these days. I feel so powerless. Oh, no. You're the opposite of powerless, Max. You think so, Samuel? You and Arcadia Bay are connected by time and tide. So, next time I have a question, I'm coming to you. Oh, my. What do you think about all those dying birds? Samuel had to bury dozens near the Tabanga. Is that the Karen? The Karen? What happened to them? I would say the sky is too dirty for their wings, but something worse is in the air. It's so ominous. Unless it's fate, then it doesn't matter. Well, I'm glad to see your squirrels are still healthy and happy on the campus. Me too. If something happened to them, oh. Not as long as you're here to take care of them, Samuel. The only thing that calms them is food. <laughs> Lots of food. Which reminds me th that I have to feed them now. That food in your belly. Birds are still up there freaking need the hell out. The universal language. Okay, what else have we got picture wise? Bird's nest with a plank and footsteps. Did I miss that? I hope not. I have to look around. It's around somewhere. Enjoy the big game, Zachary. I hope it's not the last. Justin, it's been so long since I've seen you. Try going to Blackwell. Insane. So I hear. Any word at all? Dude, I wish. Hey, Daniel. You look bummed out. Are you all right? Hola, Max. I just figured out that my photos basically suck. I'm a wannabe artist. You're not here to be a photographer. That's my gig. Look at that sketch you did of me. Incredible. And that's your art. Your gift. <sighs> I do feel better now. You are good, Max. Are you going to the end of the world party tonight? It will be if I go, man. People here push me into lockers, not dance floors. That's exactly why you should go to that party. We have to stand up to these Blackwell bullies for Kate. You won't be alone, Daniel. Not with you to back me up, Max. Oh, damn it. I will go to the party like it is the end of the world. Okay, maybe I won't go, but... No, I won't do that, but... I'll go. Have you talked to anybody about what happened with Kate? I don't talk to anybody, Max. <laughs> but, oh, I did actually have a conversation with Brooke. She was very sad about Kate. So am I. 
and angry. We should stop going to class and stage a protest. Uh, but that's not going to happen at Blackwell. Yet. I like this revolutionary Daniel DaCosta. Only if I can start the revolution from my sketchbook, Max. By the way, have you seen Nathan Prescott? You mean lately? Like, any time today? I saw Jefferson talking with Nathan a little while ago, but uh, I try to stay out of his way. I have enough assholes to deal with here. Let's talk later. Okay, Daniel? stole money from the Handicap Access Fund. We're going to hell. Oh, my sweet Kate. I can tell that Justin is really into Chloe. Chloe fits in so easy with Justin. Coast is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ah, oh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. So lame, they don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. Okay, is there like a stairwell? Stairs down? Just stairs up. Who needs a dorm map anyway? At least I can see that Nathan isn't in room 106 or 108. Who would steal cat pics? <laughs> so. They have one more meeting left. Hate World of Warcraft strategy shoes. Uh, no. I feel so bad for her and her family. Oh, why, hello, Trevor and Dana. I'm here with you, right? Even after Kate, nobody here learned anything about bullying. At least nobody messed with the Kate portrait. Zack or Logan? Who knows? Bro's got a bro. Ugh, skunkweed and video games. I sense Hayden is near. 
This just makes me think of Kate. Poor Warren. This is the work of Nathan. He's so lucky I'm a pacifist. Hello, Warren's room. Hawking and him make a good team. I can have a little fun with Warren for a change. I mean, he tries so hard and I blew off his drive-in offer. Oh, am I overthinking this? <laughs> Looks like one of the jocks did care about Kate. That's hilarious. Oh, you Bigfoots. Well, this can only be Nathan's room. I don't want to see what the other ones have, though. Oxley, yeah. Are toilet paper wars mandatory in the dorms? I look at Trevor Slate, yeah. Evan, of course. That's why no shits were given. Evan rolls. Apparently Logan missed this poster. Now I need to find Nathan's phone, or anything with clues. Nathan clearly has his fetish down. That is so Chloe. Oh my god. Chloe. Be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. That looks like a totally fun show. Even Nathan has a light side. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. If only all your energy went into photography. It's so damn creepy, but... The guy has his own style. Unfortunately, people like creepy things. Huh? That's so cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. Bastard. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, the Prescott's rule. Oh, hey, and I do have a shadow on that thing. Look. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. 
Let's see what Nathan hides in here. Nathan is way into this party. Bad sign. Now I remember why I hate you, and why Kate will get justice. Oh man, Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome and far away. Ow. Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Wow. Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. <sighs> Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from... Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. That's a lot of DVDs. These films all have a dark pattern. Is there even enough films to have a dark pattern? Look. Nathan took this from Kate's altar. Why? What is with this dude? Oh, oh. Oh, man. That dickhead stole one of my selfies. Um, I'm feeling a little worried now. Uh, thank you. Huh? Nathan Prescott, all American teen. hell are all those marks on the floor? Let's find out what you're hiding. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. I done in here? Now I have Nathan's phone so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes back. Uh, let's rewind him. Like a lot. Oh. Cool, now it's open. You're finally back. I got worried. So what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. What are you doing in my dorm? You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me, ho. <clears throat> Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. <clears throat> you are so fucking dead. <clears throat> Get off me, bro. <clears throat> <clears throat> Stop it! Come on! Oh. Oh. 
Oh, my head. Why are y'all looking at me like that, huh? You and you, you're all dead. Let's go, now. Plus, my dad is on his way. You're all fucked. He owns you. Even if Nathan definitely deserved a beating, we should try to be better than that. That was intense. Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? For headbutting Nathan Prescott. That was awesome. I don't know. I almost went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so maybe you better, um... Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. Still got the black eye. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. Seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole is going to help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. About time. I am so going to hit you. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just pay Frank his money, and then we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Close up into the whales. Let me take a picture. Nope, I don't want to go there. I do want to go there. There might not be any Pan Estates by Saturday. This is where my nightmare started. I may not know quantum speak, but there has to be an explanation. Ah. 
How can all of this not be connected to a major storm? How many damn beached whales are there? It blows my mind that I was just here with Chloe in an alternate reality. Good thing there are no actual cops around to bust us. Behold, Frank's beer garden. Take the trash out sometime, dude. This is where Frank ponders his existence and gets drunk. Oh, fresh meat. So Pompidou must be okay. Good doggy. Can't see inside with this shit blocking the view. I don't think Frank listened to my cleaning advice. It's not funny anyway. Chloe looks ready to rumble. <laughs> 